Golem is not a Pokemon that's been used to seeing a lot of competitive plays over the years, so when Alolan Golem got announced, a lot of people were speculating, is this going to be the turn for Golem? Unfortunately, that was not the case, but when Scarlet and Violet got announced, a new Pokemon got announced, Rapska. So what is so special about Rapska is the fact that it has Revival Blessing on it. What does that do, you might think? Well, it's pretty simple. You can basically just revive one of your fainted Pokemons within your party. There is a catch, though. You only can do this once per game, which is why the Rapska has the Leper Berry on it, which does that when you use a PP of one of your moves, it will regain that PP, which means you can actually do this twice in one match. So for that reason, in today's video, I'll be showcasing you guys an explosive Alolan Golem team, which of course Rapska soon can revive it after it exploded itself, Dundoso, Mouse Hopes, Iron Hands, and Sinister. So without further ado, let's just get into things. Okay, so... Tornadus, Okie Dokie, uh, Rowing Moon, Enamorous, Urshifu, and Wellspring Okupon. So, not the worst matchup I have seen. I think we can probably lead this off pretty, pretty good. Um, I do think Macha Gacha might be good in this one. And but turn, I mean, you probably have to come with as well. I just think it's going to be interesting to see how this golem team is going to do. Like, what is... How does how does a little golem work? Like, the explosive and, and, and stuff like that. Like, it, it's going to be a fun one to, to try out. Let me tell you how much. I am very, very excited to try it out. So, I mean, it's, it's probably going to be incredibly challenging and hard to use. Considering it's not really a, um, a, a metal mon. So, but I do think it might have some good potential. I mean, I saw the video on X and I was like, yeah, I, I have to try this thing off immediately. Look, I'm actually, so he didn't lead Urshifu, which is, I am quite happy with. Which means I can protect here and I can go for Trick Room. Um... Because I don't think there's any... I think he's going to double up into me. Honestly. But what do I know? I just assume he would. Okay, Raps guy's actually fairly slow too. Not even going to lie. Protect on... You. Fine. Protect on us. A bulk up. Okay. Yeah, I mean... We could have gone for at least a free body slam, but who would have, who would have thought that anyway? So, I mean, it's a good turn for us in my opinion. So, let's hit this. And then we should be able to hit the Revival Blessing. Because we should theoretically go after Golem. I do believe so. I do believe we're slower than go- oh. I mean, technically faster, which makes us slower in Trick Room. You know what I mean? I, I think we should be, like, technically. But, I guess we'll, we'll have to wait and see for this. I mean, he can protect, I guess, but... Yep, Explosion goes first. How much damage are we dealing? How much damage are we dealing? Go limb, go limb. Ah, almost enough for the KO, but we will take it. I mean, Terrestrialization would have made it enough, but. When you come for Revival Blessing. Nice. We are just going to send a uh, Golem straight back into things. Here in comes Golem. And Superpower. Okay, that doesn't affect KO. Uh, okay, so it didn't quite go as we were hoping, but... Ouch. Ouch. But it didn't go really bad, neither.
He didn't go completely terrible, but just not as expected. He, I think he's most likely going to protect on his Roaring Moon. I mean, there's a good chance. If he doesn't, that's golden for us, honestly. Okay. Yeah. I guess that's okay. And then we get to Psychic, which should KO, right? Yes, thank you. Even a crit. We'll take that. Do we still have Trick Room up here? Because that would be gorgeous. Enamorous. Okay. So this is the fast Enamorous. Which means a couple different things. Means we can do this and we can do this. And it should quite frankly work. Yes, Revival Blessing once again. This is why you have that Baryon, honestly. I don't revive Golem here. Drain Punch. Rolling Moon goes down. Nice. Nice. And Amherst goes super power. <sighs> okay. So not. Okay. We're still in Trick Room, right? We are indeed. So we could Wild Charge. Enamorous. And Psychic Urshifu, right? I don't know how much damage we're going to deal, but probably a decent chunk. Close enough for a KO. I'm taking that any day of the week. Wild Charge should be a KO, though. That is a KO. So most likely this is going to be a wrap. Mainly because it's 4 against 1 now. Urshifu goes for Surgings. Which is fine, I guess. Dimensions to normal. Bring in Sinister. Hospitality. Nice. And drain punch. And trick room. So no matter what happens now, we're going to take the first up here. Let's go. Elven Golem. Actually doing some pretty good work here. I mean, we didn't get the KOs, but it was, it was still down to the point where it was really, really good. And we get it revived anyway. So twice in fact. <laughs> but, you know, we let's move on to the second one to see if we can do some of the same stuff and get that explosion off okay okay iron hands is suing um gudra tornadoes flutter blood moon and the urshifu what can we do here folks what can we do here we could just do this lead this actually and we could go for you just go for the exact same four months in fact I think, I think that might actually be pretty, pretty solid. Hmm. For a bunch of different reasons. Um. But. I guess there's only one way to find out, realistically. Um. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Let's see here. So you did not lead off with what I expected. Hmm. 
Okay, let's go for white card protect. This might be a bit risky. Oh, that's actually cool. I didn't know that animation was in Golem. That's pretty nice. Shadow Ball is quite scared of that, not gonna lie. It's not enough. Blood Moon, what do you do? Please go for Hyper Voice. That'd be phenomenal. Nope. Of course you didn't go for that. No. Of course you didn't go for that. That is, of course, what... Fucking hell, bruv. We should have just protected, honestly. We should have just protected. I pr it was a little bit too risky. But I think we're going to lose Sinister here. Uh, unfortunately. But draw is okay. And switch is in what? Do draw? Okay, Revival Blessing comes out, nice. Let's go, might get a chance again. We'll see though. And Hyper Voice, yep. I do feel like he is gonna protect. Which is why I'm just gonna revival bliss again and protect on Golem. Mainly because I feel like he is gonna protect. And if so, then we will get the chance to bring back. Okay, he's just not. He's just doing everything I'm not expecting, which is actually fucking insane. He's just playing this completely different than I than I would expect. Blood Moon, Rafter goes down. I mean, I guess Rafter has done way more than it should have done. And then what do you do? Shell, Muddy Water. Okay, that's fair enough. Muddy Water is fair enough there. Please trigger one more. End with you. Heal up a little bit. Send you to the Furious. That's actually a cool attack. I can it's not gonna work against you it's not gonna work oh my god I completely forgot about that it's not gonna work oh why did I not I, did, I completely forgot about it it turned into electric types which means it's not gonna do well against ground type why did I not think of that oh my god I'm such a noob champs I am such a noob champs what am I even what am I Champs, what what am I thinking? What am I thinking here, champs? Like I am just not cooking. And of of course he terrestrialized. Of course he did. I mean, of course, right? Like you have to, right? And then he's gonna hyper voice. No, you're gonna earth power. Are you fucking kidding me? This can't be true. Like, this can't be true. It just can't be true, bro. How? Oh, paralysis. Nice. Please don't move. No. Ye oh my god, this was this matchup was such a noob turn for us. Oh, not turn, it was like just a whole we just played really bad to be honest. We played really, really bad. 
There's not really much else we can say. Oh, of course you have Sips have on as well. Like, of course. In the, of course. Gudra, why would you... You're the first to assume Gudra I've ever met with that on, I think. Like, the months we are meeting recently is actually fucking crazy. However, Hisun Gudra is a very strong Pokemon to go. Like, looking at it right now, it looks really strong into, like, Urshifu, but that it, it, it doesn't take away the fact that who has Sips Hammer on? Nobody does. Oh, my God. Let's try and get into Fern and Vine Match and see if we can finally get this explosion. Um... Explosion um, strategy to work. Okay, no fake out here. Maybe we have a chance of doing what I want to do here. Just, but just maybe, just maybe. Freak it, let's go. Let's try. He can lead off Landris. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna, I'm gonna click, click that explosion button anyway. I don't care. I have to click this thing out anyway. Now I don't give a fuck no more. We have to, to get this thing off. I do not care. I need, I need to try and get that explosion thing off. Um, I, I, I need to. I mean, come on. There's no way. Like, it has to be because it's gone so viral. This strategy that that's why everybody knows what the fuck I'm up to. That has to be it. Like, there's no way it's otherwise than that. It just there just isn't. Like it's just impossible. Chin Powell and Landris lead. Okay. I mean, there's just no way. It has to be because he's trying to U-turn, right? And then Sacred Sword or something. There has to be that. We'll draw us Landris. No you no U-turn. And Mungus comes in. Stressization on the Chin Pao already? Ghost type? Sad. This is a long one, folks. This is a long one. What do you go for? Sacred Sword? Uh, pretty much expected. Means we have to terrestrialize. I feel like he is going to protect, though. There's just no way, like, there's just no way he's not going to protect, right? But I'm also an idiot for what I just did. My brain is just not working today. I was like, he's gonna project Chin Power, therefore I'm not gonna go for Explosion. Instead, I decide to double up into Chin Power, which is even worse considering what I just did. Like, I'm just a fucking idiot at this point. Like, what am I even doing playing right now? What, like, what am I even doing? I'm not even thinking clear anymore. What am I fucking doing? Oh, and now he's gonna spoil me, which is even worse. Fucking insane now, aren't you? There's nothing I can do about it. We we screwed up big time. We just screwed up big time. Because I don't know how we're gonna come back from this. We completely just fucked ourselves over. I have no idea how I'm gonna come back from this, honestly. I 
guess that's fair. I guess that's very much fair enough. Wait, what? We wake up? Ah, oh, bro. Okay. And he trend comes in. Now that is interesting. And Amoongus avoids. How much? I mean, probably not going to do much damage. Nope, not at all. Spore doesn't need to protect slot. You know what? I guess it's fucking time. Let's press the shit. Do we want to terrestrialize and just go full send it? I think we don't. I think we don't do that. Okay, full send. It's all or nothing. If you switch us into Landris now, then screw us. Please don't do that. Please don't do that. Please. And don't protect, please. That's just even worse. Why did I not think of that? I told you guys, my brain just doesn't work today. I am just too focused on... Oh, how do you predict that switch out, bro? How is that possible? Oh, bro. How? For fuck's sake, man. We're getting... We're getting clapped. Like, I'm not even joking, bro. We're getting absolutely clapped. Oh, do you switch in Landris? Yeah, we're getting absolutely clapped right now. Like, I'm not, not kidding. We're getting absolutely clapped. Like, we are actually getting clapped really bad right now. We still sleep, which is quite bad. But you go for pollen puff. Not expected, champs. Not expected. U turn. Okay, I guess that's fair. What comes in? He turn again. Probably right. I mean, it has to be Heatran. Chin Pao? Mm, fair enough, fair enough. Rocky Helmet, of course. Who, who would have predicted that? Rafka wakes up. Oh. Oh. That was actually fairly nice right there. That is enough for KO though, so now we fucked.
I mean, I feel like it's the only thing I can do, what I'm trying to do right now. But I could be extremely wrong. Um... Let's see. I mean... I we just did not get to utilize this team correctly now, did we? Like, it's looking really rough on us. At the moment, we are just not doing great, if I have to be honest. Protect and Shin Pao. You're kidding me. Yep. We're just getting played around it right now. Like, honestly. Burn, please. Not even a burn. We have you can send in there, which I can hit really well. Honestly, I feel like he's gonna switch in for Heatran. This is our only way back in the game. Only way back. Okay. Yeah. Never mind. Never mind. Screw this. We lost. Never mind. Screw this. We fucking lost, chat. We fucking lost again. Ah, oh, when am I gonna fucking get a team that's good? Please. Like, I was so excited to use this team and people just fucking know how to play it. It's not fucking fun, bro. Like, fuck off. I mean, I guess that's it for the free videos. Uh, not free videos. I said that again. Dang it. The free matches per video. Um, We didn't even get to try out Dundo, so mousehold. Uh, we used the same four every single time. Just the only one that made sense in my opinion and then yeah i don't know <laughs> i thought it was gonna be really really funny to play with a little golem explosion like i was so excited to try with the rapska it worked out once and that's about it it didn't really work to be honest at its full potential so I, for that i mean gimmick and reasoning to build this team and how funny it would be like that's completely a 10 out of 10 but like for this whole team combined, this whole unit, that's a, that's a 3 out of 10. Honestly, I did not like playing, playing with this team. I thought it was going to be funny. I did not have fun at all. I thought it was so hard to play with. I did not have fun at all. So, therefore, I have to give it a... <coughs> oh, excuse me. I have to get it a 3 out of 10, unfortunately. But it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? So... I mean, if you guys have a team you want to feature in a future video on Ranked, then make sure you leave me that range code down in the comment section below, and I'll make sure to do so, because I would very much like to do that. Um, but yeah, this team just did not do it for me. Yeah, I, I don't really know what much else to say. It was just not for me. So if you could use today's video for anything, which I assume you could, because you're still sitting around watching it, make sure you smash the thumbs up button, because that would help me massively as a content creator. Make sure you subscribe to the channel as well while you are down there because we are getting very close to a thousand subs, I would say. And when we do, we will play black and white here on the channel on the live stream. And uh, I haven't played the game, so I mean, why not? That's our 1000 sub special goal. And um, yeah, make sure you subscribe because it is free. So I mean, why not? I mean, let's be honest, you have nothing to lose. Only things to gain, right? So otherwise, I hope to see you guys in my next video. And as always, happy gaming.